been a while, right? What, like over a week? I'm back. Sorry, guys. Take a little break. I was going crazy. People say that like they're joking. I was really going crazy. Um, but today, I got something excited for you guys. I've been waiting to get the monochrome uh, Instax film since like I first heard the rumor, like the idea about it last year. And they finally came out with it. So I ordered two packs and uh, it, it got here. So I wanted to do like some street portraits. It's been a while since I've even done that and shared that with you guys, especially since vlogging. And I felt like this is the perfect opportunity to go out and make some cool, like kind of vintage, like nostalgic type portraits and test like the black and white film out. I wanted to do a GoPro point of view, but the Instax camera that I have doesn't have a tripod mount, so that's impossible. So I told Des to meet me at Campus Marshes. He's gonna film it. Not sure how the audio is gonna be, how close he's gonna be, but at least you guys can kind of get that behind the scenes visual. So about to meet up with him, get set up, and get these portraits going. All right, guys. So I get the Campus Marshes, and it looks like it's closed down. This sucks. Um, hopefully this goes well. It's about one o'clock right now. And I had plans to shoot about seven or eight like people. And it's kind of a ghost town down here. A lot of construction workers, a lot of uh, security, but not like really many people. What I'm looking for is just somebody with like some real character, an older face or uh, something, something unique. Like, so hopefully I can run into about six or seven people. I have 20 exposures. I typically use like three or four like with each person. So we'll see how that works out. Um, Desmond's still nowhere to be found. Our meetup location is closed, so hopefully I'll run into him. So while we're waiting on Desmond, I guess we can go ahead and uh, load the camera. This is the uh, monochrome film. Uh, it doesn't come like in a devil pack or anything just yet. Pretty expensive, about like 15 bucks. Oh, me unboxing this. It's the new Instax. Like that. What's the point of view? Oh, I just record myself every day. <laughs> like, uh huh. Just me like walking around. And I, I don't have friends, so I just talk to the camera. You should, you should, you should watch it. It's, <laughs> it's pretty entertaining. People want you to vlog, bro. You gotta vlog every day. Man, this is mad depressing, bro. What? Christmas lights and shit. You don't like Christmas lights? I mean, that just means winter is coming. You don't like winter? It's the hey. best time for street photography, man. People are all bundled up looking cold. Like, oh. But I'm also bundled up cold. So I'll be shooting with the monochrome film. You guys like it? You guys have a hard day at work? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Why is this in like auto mode? Should I put it on sunny or cloudy? Uh, no. So like this song? I'm taking a picture of you off. first, right? I wanna see your face though. It's a dollar a film, man. Man, that's a guy. <laughs> she was mad bright. He said what? Hey. <laughs> I like this lady's outfit, but that's not gonna be in the picture. So. It's gonna be a long video. Right. Right there. Like a ticket picture, sir? Do you want a post office? Yeah, I'm taking a picture. Alright, did I blind you at all? No. Have a good day, thank you. I couldn't think of a live fast enough. I'm <laughs> doing a, a post office thing. I don't know. Let's count down how this develops. Start the timer. Uh, it's all uh, black and white film, man. Nighttime. Like Nikon. <laughs> Nighttime. Oh, it does actually, you're right? Four years. <laughs> <laughs> what an advanced thing. Is this a quick picture? Uh, yeah, it's cool. Okay. Maybe you can see the earrings in it.
right, guys. So right now we're at Lumicon, which is like an event in uh, downtown Detroit. People dress up as like anime characters, or I don't really don't know what this is, but it's super cool. Uh, Dude, it's probably been here like three, four years ago. I would have thought this was extremely weird, but because I'm passionate about something, it's exciting to see like other passionate people. And people are like going all out. I've seen like some great costumes. Uh, Desmond's really mad that he didn't get dressed up, but next year for sure. And yeah, we can't get into the actual event, but like they let us come in and walk around and see people. So I'm just gonna like go put my camera in people's faces and like, you know, just see, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I just want to know why people are here and how they became so passionate. Terrible experience. Uh -huh. <laughs> that was that was pretty weird. I'm not gonna lie. Um, probably shouldn't be saying this on the steps of the event. Everybody here is pretty serious about you know their craft, but it was interesting. It was cool to see people like I said, people just inspired and like passionate. I wish they had something like that in Detroit for photography, where we can like dress up as like Chase Jarvis or something like that, or I don't know, Brisson or whatever. But yeah, so Desmond, what are we what are we doing now? Uh, we need to go to a coffee shop. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna go email. to a coffee shop. We're gonna email somebody. I'm done with this uh, Fujifilm Instax. I'm gonna show you guys the film when I get home. I don't wanna look at all of them because I kinda wanna have like a first real impression. And um, yeah, we're about to head to the coffee shop. There's like this event that happened yesterday in Detroit where all these people who were like no better than me got funded all this money. And uh, I'm just kidding by the way, but I'm kinda serious. So yeah, we're about to go like figure out how we can be a part of that because we need money. All right, guys, finally home. Um, I wanted to stay at the coffee shop and get work done, but I think I was just caffeined out. I started like getting anxiety and freaking out, and it was kind of crazy. Um, anyway, yeah, I got a couple things to do on the computer, but before I ended the vlog, I just wanted to talk about the um, Fujifilm Monochrome Instax. And overall, I was pleased. Um, I was shooting in daylight, and it was a much better experience than I've had before. I was shooting with the um, Instax Mini 8, and they came out pretty good. I think I had like two overexposed shots and everything else was pretty much a contrasty black and white. I'll do like a quick um, overview of them all tomorrow when it's better, you know, light in my apartment so you guys can check them out. But yeah, you know, it took a while for them to develop. That was the first thing that I noticed. It took a considerably amount of long time. I think I took a, my first shot at Desmond and then we walked around and took like another shot, looked at it and it was kind of like uh, overexposed. And then like 10 minutes later, I looked at it and I was like, oh, okay. So they, they did come out pretty contrasty. I read online that they had like a blue tone to them. I didn't see that in my images. Um, again, I was shooting outdoors, didn't see any uh, blue tones at all. I also did read that it happened over a period of time. So we'll check back tomorrow to make sure that they're, you know, just as contrasty in black and white. Uh, I want to like give you guys like a really good comparison. Like, oh, it looks like Neopan or whatever, but I honestly don't know. Um, to me, it's pretty contrasty. Um, yeah, it's like like really, really dark. So, yeah, I mean, we'll, we'll check them out tomorrow. Like I said, I'll, I'll give you guys an over. Well, let's see how the light looks now. Um, like, here's one of the kid who thought that I was, you know, famous via Instagram. So you can kind of see the, the black and whites. Here's a one that was kind of overexposed. This was like a moving shot of a guy crossing the street. And then, uh, Here's one that was taken in like really direct sunlight and you can't see him at all. And then like this is how most of them came out. So kind of just like really punchy looking. I really like it. I really like it. So overall, I'm pretty happy with it. Um, I still got like five shots in there left. But yeah, I'm about to sign off. I got to uh, send out a couple emails, finish up with me and Desmond working on and edit this vlog. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace. Alright, give us, give us.
Kill that shoot. He was at it. He was killing it.